bring it, bring it. <laughs> 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 Get ready, it's our turn. Took us our blessing, let me took Adenka home. My friend, leave this. Took me blessing. Give me blessing, let us went home. Give us the blessing, uncle. Let us went home with our wife. Come, Adenka, come. Stand up, stand up, stand up. Everybody clap. Hey, you both win. You both win. My heart beat. Aroma. You startled me. What is it? What bothers you? Why are you crying? Please, do not call me your heart beat again. The air has ears. Besides, you are now a married man. And your wife Erima is very possessive. So I do not want to be in competition with anybody and not your wife. So please, stop! You know, aroma is not a match for you. You know in your heart, you know the truth. You're the one I love. Indeed. You're the one I want. You say you love me. Yes. Yet you went and married another woman. And you talk about love. Please let go, let go. Please, 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 <gasps> please. Calm down. You will not understand. Look, you're the only one I love, and the only one I will ever love. I swear, nothing changes. This you hurt me. I will not let you go. Obi, I love you. I will never love you less. Please, calm down. Please. Every night when the moon comes out from its hiding place, he makes love to me in the most, in the most passionate way. Am I not lucky? Erima, the most beautiful and priceless maiden in the whole of Ajasa. Endeared and entwined by the tiger himself, Igwe Kanayo, and the gods of our land. To the most handsome, the most endearing man in Najasa. Oh, my busy. Tell me, my friend, am I not lucky? No, I don't think you are so lucky. What do you mean by that? What do you mean you don't think I am so lucky? Oh! Adinka! Wait, wait. Don't tell me you have been jealous of me! Oh, far from it. 
Then what is it? Me. Jealous of you. So speak. What is it? On my way to the farm, I saw something. What did you see? I saw your husband, Ndobisi, and his sister, Aroma. It's a lie! Wait, let me finish. In some sort of romance, to me, I don't think it's just a sister or brotherly meeting. What did you see? I said, why did you say that? I like your skin. Oh, stop, please. You're flattering me. I'm not. You are. And I'll kill any young man that comes close to you. <laughs> hey! 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 Irima, what is it? What do you mean, what is it? Who is it? watch you. Stay away from my husband. I am warning you. Stay away from my husband. What is wrong with you? Why are you shouting? He is my brother. And my he blood. is my husband. My husband. I have the final say. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> Whatever. Irima, what has come over you? What is all this? Hey, let me see. Look at you. You're asking me, Irima, what has come over you? You want to know what has come over me? Show you. Ah, ah, Irima! Ah, Irima! Ah, have you gone mad? Don't be busy. Don't try me. Don't try me! What sort of embarrassment? Irima! No, no. Irima! This woman has lost it. Irima, let me go. She has lost it. What are you saying, Aroma? You and I know this is not good. Ndobisi is not just any man. But our relative, it is not acceptable. I love him so much, Ede. Neither you or anyone else can understand that. Just let me be. How can you love your own blood? What are you saying? What do you know? What do you know about love? You obviously want to understand. I understand, Aroma. I understand. This kind of love between family members is a taboo. <laughs> it is not. The heart goes for what it wants. It is not my choice. I will continue to love Ndobisi for the rest of my life. I just want you to know that. Even as married? Not even marriage. Not even marriage or anything can come between the flames of love we both shared. Excuse me. to stay away from her. Irima, don't tell me you're jealous of her. What? Jealous of who? I can never be jealous of that insignificant being. Why should I be jealous of her? Talking about beauty, I am way better than her or any other maiden in the whole of Ajasa. And what else? Talking about... Enough! Enough! Is it not evident that somehow you feel intimidated and threatened by her to even think that I will have an affair with my own sister? It is not just the thoughts, Ndubisi. It's not just the thoughts. It is the closeness. She is my sister. Oh. I'm only fond of her. Fond of her, my foot. Erima, I don't have anything to do with her. You're my wife, and the only one I love that way. Okay? And, and where are you going? You, you want to go back to her, right? Will you stop monitoring me? I am your husband, not your subject. Learn to speak to me with respect. Ndobisi! Oh, 
Piageli. Oh! The light of my heart. Why do you have that worrisome look on your face? My lord, hmm. I have not seen my son today. <laughs> Obiageli, the son is not a kid anymore. He has gone out with uh, one of the guards. No, my lord. They said he refused them from following him. Mm -hmm. That he wanted to go alone. Mm -hmm. And I am worried. Mm -hmm. So he left and went alone. He is not a kid. Your son will return. Huh? Now, see, don't fret. He will come back. Ah, oh my one. Woman. Hey, hey, hey! The great wanderer of Ajasala. What should I call you? Tell me. <laughs> um, okay. Lost soul. Or what else should I call you? <laughs> hey! And what is the meaning of this madness of yours? What? Well, I do not have time for insignificant worm like you. Hey! Are you waiting for your brother, NWC? Or should I call him your, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it is very, very obvious to me now that you are jobless. What is more interesting? The smile on your face whenever you are in Tell me, my husband, is it just the hunting or is there something else to it? Tell me the truth. Is it just the hunting or Maybe. Blood is what if I am overthinking? What if they are nothing but relatives who are just fond of each other? She was here waiting for me. If that nagging woman had not had not delayed me earlier, I, I, I would have met her here. Adinka, you startled me. Why? Were you expecting someone? 
Someone? Someone like who? Of course not. As you can see, I'm on my way to... to... to check my traps. Excuse me. This cannot be coincidence. They are in love. <gasps> this cannot happen. What are you telling me? What are you saying? Do you realize the gravity of, of falling in love with your own sister? I know. Uzumba, I know. Hey, what about Irima? Don't you love her? Is it not obvious that I do not love her? Then why marry her? Uzumba, I was just a fool. I was only fulfilling her obligations. But she knew from onset that I never loved her. Ndubisi, uh, 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 you're my best friend. And you know, I, I will always be there for you. But I must tell you the truth. This is wrong. This is very, very wrong. You better put a hand to this before it gets a calamity that shakes the whole village. This is wrong. You are thinking about him again. Is it that deep? Ede, you will not understand. He has stolen my entire being. For how long have you felt this way? For as long as I can remember. Even though we tried so hard not to make it go so deep, but we couldn't control it. Oh. Now I realize it. What are you talking about? Some time ago, I, I saw it vividly and clearly that we are cursed. An old woman appeared in my dream and spoke directly to me about it. Ide, you have started again. What are you talking about? What are you seeing this time? Aroma, this is the curse. I am certain about it. What curse? Idi, I hope you're not trying to blackmail me with your trance and dreams. Now listen and listen very carefully. When it comes to this love, no trance, no dreams, no vision, no past, no future can ever come between us. Ever. I hope I am well understood. Why are you doing this, young woman? Who are you? And what is it that I'm doing? I am Unduru. Jiji of Ozumba. The one you are trying so hard to destroy his relationship with your friend. Put a stop to this. Your evil plans against him. Else! Else what? Hey, young man! Else what? You kill me? Eh? I am all I fear nothing. 
not even you. So please, you better mind your business. Hey! 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 He's gone. No. Why? We can't stop this. I mean, this is this is all we are living for. We have to tame this love because we are nothing but prisoners of love, and it's not good. We are not prisoners of love. We are prisoners of fate. I love you so much. And you know it. Such a goddess. When you were coming, I couldn't help but notice your exceptional beauty. You are such a man with this sweet word, Ozumba. Oh. And I love you. No, I do not flatter you. I'm telling you the truth. You are the most beautiful maiden in the whole of Ajasa Kingdom. You, you're a goddess. You, your beauty redeems the whole place. Give me your Zumba stop. Um, Thank you. Thank you for the sweet words. You're so beautiful and that's why I love you. I love you too. Mm. Where are you going to? Um, I want to see my friend on the busy. So my son, which made him get in mm. Erima. Who? There is no maiden beautiful enough for me in this kingdom. There is only one maiden I love, and her name is Irima. Stop it! Stop it! I forbid you from mentioning that name here. My son, get to see that she is a married woman. Mm. This is not love, but lust. More than that. I do not care, mother. She is the only woman I love. Excuse me. Son! My lord, your son is treading on a dangerous path. And this is not good for him. And you quite. Hey! Hi! Hey. Adimka. What is it? Why are you running as though you are set from the hills? My eyes. My eyes! Oh! What is wrong with your eyes? What happened? My eyes have seen wonders in this land. Speak forth. Is it about my husband and that trash? Your husband 
and the one you call trash are together. It's a lie! It's a lie. It is the truth. Erima, you have to open your eyes. That girl you call trash is gradually taking your husband's attention away from you. They may be relatives, but I tell you, she is the one he loves. No. Ndobisi cannot mock me. He cannot mock me. What? Is that all you have to say? Oh. Oh, that cursed worm will hear from me. She will hear from me. That's my Erima talking. I expected you to do this a long time. Ndobisi, you will not take me for granted. You will not take me for granted. I am not a fool. Irima, what do you speak of? What do I speak of? You must think that I am a very naive and insensitive woman. Where have you been? Irima, instead of you to constantly attack me, you should be showing me how much you love me. Showing you how much I love you? How? How do I do that? Come of it, Ndubisi. You do not even care. Yes, I do. I care. But there is no love there. All there is, is bitterness. Don't you dare. Don't you dare speak of bitterness to me. When all you've done is maltreat me since the first day of our marriage. Are you blind, deaf or dumb? Which of the above? Are you talking to me? Wait. You're asking if... Oh, good. Irima. Yes. You seek my presence. Yes. What is it? A simple question I have for you. What do you want from my husband? Why is he with you? Aroma, why won't you let me be? Why do you seek to divide my home? Why are you threatening my marriage? I ask you a question, answer me. Erima, it is all in your head. Your husband is my brother. And there is nothing between us. Nothing, you see. Yet you have robbed him with you. Obviously trying to, to lure him into your magnet of misfortune. Take that back! I will not take it back! Are you not a magnet of misfortune? Erima, you are wrong. Once again, I have no secret whatsoever with your husband. Go home and put your house together and stop transferring your, your frustration on me. Fine. I will believe you this time. But listen to me. Listen to me very carefully and pay attention to the fire in my eyes. I swear, if I find out that you are having an affair with my husband, I swear by the gods of Ajasa, I will pluck your eyes. Let's start sink. <laughs> Enough! Go and meet your wife! I've had
had enough. Obi, Obi, please. Obi, Obi, Obi. You heard her. Go home. Shut up. You must speak to me with respect. Now talk to your sister. Tell her I await her tonight. Greetings, Father. Where are you going? Father, since when did I go back to being a small boy? I am an adult. I can go to anywhere I choose to go to. We can, Naya. Yes, you're an adult. But you see, Ever since you started this, your wild, foolish preference for married women, it has gotten us worried. Very, very worried. Worried to the extent that if perchance you foolishly consummate your actions, then our name, reputation, everything about this palace goes down in ruin. Father, let me worry about me and my actions. Again, I, I forbid you. I forbid you from going in search of married women. Dare to stop me. Dare. You may help me. This love. This love is driving me insane. I need your help. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Tell me. What do you seek? And what have you decided? I have decided to fight. To fight for this love and not let it die. I have come for your alliance. You're the only one that can help me. Ezedibia, you swore to protect me. Remember the relationship between your late father, Ezedibia Nkembo, and my late father. A relationship that has continued with us till date. You cannot turn your back on me now. Now that I need you the most. Ezedibia, Aroma is, is the only girl I've known as a sister and a lover. You would not want to throw me into the lion's den by revealing our secret. Please, Ezedibia, help me by protecting this secret. Please help me. I am touched by your speech. My father still speak through me, though I am blind, but I can see the truth. You have my silence. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Mm. May the gods bless you with more wisdom. Thank you. Thank you, Ezedibia. Thank you. Thank you. 
No man can judge no one. Tell the one that made it to me. Why are you keeping me quiet? You're killing me. Why are you crying? You don't want to say anything. Oh, Guinea. Mama, it isn't to be seen. It isn't to be seen. What did he do? Mother, as if our marriage is not bad enough, he has gotten worse. What did he do to you? Did he raise his hands on you? Mother, it is worse than that. I wish he raised his hands on me. Mother, I have totally lost him. Mother, he sucks my breast no more. He, he doesn't even devote my pot of pleasure anymore. He has eyes on that girl. He has eyes on that, that two-faced, wretched sister of his. What did you just say? Aroma. May the gods forbid. Aroma is his blood sister. <laughs> Greetings, Ezebia. I of the gods. What the gods are angry. And I cannot keep the secret any longer. Ezebia, I have tried. I have tried to kill and bury this villain. But to no avail. I try harder. <laughs> For when the dark cloud peruses the sky and the evil set to loom the wondrous sky, then you shall cease to love her. <laughs> I of the gods, I, I am nothing but... Ah! <laughs> enough is enough! You shall do this very fast, else I shall expose you. I of the gods. <laughs> There's a Libya. <laughs> Your love and not in the busy. Listen, I have been waiting to tell you that I can no longer continue with this relationship. I cannot continue anymore. I mean, this is too much for me. My love, I know. I know we've been through a lot, especially you. But we cannot stop love from existing. We have to stop it, kill it, and destroy it. Something within me tells me that this love will be our death. Then let it be our death. I am ready to die in your arms, my love. It will be the greatest gift from the gods. To be said, please, what is wrong with you? Please do not bring the gods into this. Else they will remember us and crush us to shafts. Not until we consummate our love. <laughs> again, and again, and again, and again. Stop! What love are you talking about? We are nothing but prisoners of love. And that is what will remain for the rest of our lives. Then let us be prisoners of love forever. As long as we share and wallow in this secret bliss, my love. To be seen. I, 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 I will meet you. Um. You know I'm your brother. And I will always protect you from evil. Don't worry. <coughs> Erima. Erima. Uh, any problem? 
I was only talking with my sister. Arwama! Stay! Stay! Touch me! Stay away from my husband. Irima! Ndubisi! Irima! Have you lost your mind? Daliense! Esamiliense! Come with me! Irima, have you gone mad? You are mad! Why are you here? Let's go home! Irima! Irima, you're hurting me! Sorry. Ah, Ma, you kept me waiting. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so, so sorry. So Why are you now? smiling? <laughs> <sighs> I don't know why I'm smiling. I'm just happy. You need to see the way Ozumba sang for me today. <sighs> My Ozumba, tell me, Oledo, am I not lucky to have him? Lucky with who? Ozumba, of course. <laughs> he bears his love to me as if we are bonded by the gods. I love him. <laughs> My dear Ma, don't be too sure about it. Don't be too sure. Why does she speak to me in such a manner? Oledo, wait! Close your eyes. Why are you asking me to close my eyes? Oh, just close your eyes. Don't you trust me? What is it that you want to tell me? Tell me. Close your eyes. Okay. Hmm? My eyes are closed. <clears throat> are you sure? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I love you, Uma. <laughs> You're the most beautiful maiden in the whole of Adjasa Kingdom. <laughs> your beauty. It's like the sun that lights up the sky and leaves the spots. Oh, Ozumba, your words are like sweet wine. So sweet to the soul that it sent Shiva down my spine. Mm. Ozumba, listen, I love you. Ma, I love you too. And I'm so privileged to have you. Come here. I love you. <laughs> I love you, Ma. I will forever love you. If only you give me the chance to love you. Of course you know I love you. Stop. <laughs> How can Uma be this happy? Yet I'm here alone wishing for love. This has to stop. And very fast. I have to put an end to whatever they share. I have to. Yes. I have to put an end to it. Oh, Ma. She can't be happy. I have to put an end to it. My friend, my friend. What are you doing here, and Why the sad look on your face? You are the cause of my sad look. Hey! <laughs> How? I don't understand. How can I be the reason behind your sad look? Tell me. <laughs> Ma, are you blind? Can't you see that that man, Ozumba, has nothing to offer? Eh? Aside his looks, he has nothing to offer. Oh, spare me that. Stop it, Oledo, stop it. Hey, Ma. Ma, my friend, please open your eyes. Eh? Can't you see that Ozumba is a womanizer? Who goes around the village Falling with other beautiful maidens. Really? He did it to me. I showed him. Well, Oledo, listen. I am not interested in your fabricated stories. Okay? Please. Oh, Ma! You did not believe me. She did not believe me. Ah. We shall see. We shall see. What is it? What is bothering you? you? You've not said anything. Everything. Everything around me is fighting our love tale. I mean everything. I don't understand. Everything. What exactly is 
This everything you speak about. The chief priest is a Dibia. He's at the verge of exposing us. And there is nothing I can do about it. Because if he does, I shall be a laughing stock. And Aroma, my beloved, shall be a thing of mockery. Hmm. I see. Now I've realized I shouldn't have married Erima. That is the biggest mistake of my life. There shall never be love or peace between us. I'm to see you, my friend. And I must tell you the truth. With aroma, yes, there's love between you both. But peace? I doubt. Mind you, if you keep this up, you end up hiding this for a very long time. And like you know, there's nothing hidden under the sun forever. Someday the people will find out. Then what will you do? What will you do when the people find out what is actually going on between two of you? Uh, I suggest you end this and try to build love over my dead body. That will never happen. Aroma is the only one I love. And the only one I will ever love for the rest of my life. I see. I see. As usual. I guess you never needed my advice. You only needed someone to validate your point on your love for Aroma. But my friend, I shall not support evil. It is wrong. She, she, she's your relative, for goodness sake. I saw them. I saw them at Tim Kadi. They were so close. He, he, he was holding her so close. But, but then... But then what? Something else bothered me last night. Something else like what? Irina, you know I love to know all the information. Yes. So please tell me. <laughs> you like to get all the information, even if you do not know what to do with them. I had a different thought. What if, what if what? What if we are mistaken? What if they have nothing to... I mean, what if they are not entwined? Don't play that naive woman, Irima. You and I know that something is actually going on between them. Yes. But thinking of it from a different perspective. I, I feel he is, is showing her that kind of affection, knowing fully well that she is the only sister he has. I think I think of it. If they had something going on, the gods would have disgraced them. He would have revealed everything. Hey! Erin Ma, the gods are wise. Maybe they are just waiting for the right time. No. I just... Hey, Erin Ma, there is nothing to think about. You know the truth. You're just trying to deny it. You just want to lay low. Maybe when she finally takes your man from you, then you will open your eyes and act. She will not dare. She has even dared you and more. Adinka, what do I do? I'm confused. What do I do? You need to confront her. Put her in her place where she belongs. That is what you need to do. Yes. She, 
She caught us and slapped me. She slapped you? Fede, wait! Please, do not go. It will give credence that everything is true. Aroma, who will you stop this your flitting, burning desire? It has to stop, please. I'm trying. I'm trying, my brother, but Ndubisi wouldn't let me. He keeps coming back. And whenever he does, I get entrapped into his love nest. His eyes. His eyes holds me bare. And the next minute, I am bedazzled into his harrowing desire. My brother, I need help. I am disturbed and on the edge. I need someone to help me out of this love that seeks to claim my entire being. Please. You are my brother and my best friend. Please. Hey. Oh, Ledu, you, you just startled me. <laughs> Is that all I do to you? Hmm? Hey, stop it. I beg you, pardon. Stop. I was just here waiting for... Uh, me? You're waiting for me, isn't it? Huh? Mom, what is, what is wrong with you? <laughs> you are... Yes, I'm here. Mama, I, I, I saw him. So he told me you were coming. So I decided to wait for your arrival. Isn't it? <laughs> that is exactly what I would do. All I do. Hey, this is why you are smiling like this. You'll be with him again, right? Of course, yes. Hey. I was with Azumba. He told me sweet words that got me basking in euphoria. Listen, all I do. Ozumba is not what you think he is. He's Yoko. Yes. Hey, Mama, my friend. Eh? I've heard you. I will give him the benefit of doubt. Oh? He sure do. Eh. Eh, eh, that reminds me. When are you going to see him again? You mean Ozumba? Yes. <laughs> okay, see. <clears throat> I'm going to be at his abode before twilight. Hey. I can't wait to see him. Hey! Hey! Yes. <laughs> oh, the man. Okay, uh, shall we? Sure. <laughs> hey! Oh! Really? And who were you waiting for? And what business of yours is it? <laughs> Aroma. <laughs> Aroma. Take a look at you. With all your beauty. No man, not even the worst of them all, looks your way. Erima. Is that not odd? Erima, do not offend me. No! I do not wish to offend you. It's just a pity that you, that you are a beautiful mistake. Excuse me. Erima, what did you just say? You heard me right. Or maybe, maybe it's a curse <sighs> or a bane. But listen to me, Aroma. If you are cursed, let that curse be fulfilled on you and you alone. Do not drag my husband into it. You know what, Erima? I will just respect you because you are the wife of my brother. I will not stand here and listen to this rubbish you have to say to me. Oh, come back here! You know what? I find it very endearing that you and your brother are inseparable. <laughs> Aroma, let me warn you. Stay away from my husband. I repeat, stay away from my husband! Erima! <laughs> or maybe, just maybe you are a witch. But let me tell you, the next time I see you anywhere around my husband, 
You see these eyes of yours? I will pluck them. That no man will ever look your way. You can do nothing. Oh. Read my lips, Erima. You can do nothing to me. <laughs> You're nothing but a noise maker. You can do nothing to me, not in this life and in the next life to come. You can do nothing. Now get your filthy hands off me, you jealous and insecure woman. It's fine. But we shall see. We shall see nothing. Fine. We shall see nothing, Arima. We shall see nothing. Why don't you just let me be? Why don't you always stalk me around? Is it a crime to be close to my brother? What nonsense. Arima, I'm off to check my second trap for the day. Okay, um, make sure you catch the biggest of them all, okay? I'll try. <laughs> You do not know what is coming your way. My love. Stop, stop, stop it! This will never happen again. This will be the end of our love tale. Roma, it is me, Ndubisi, the love of your life. Please. Let go of me. Let go. Roma, is that what you really want? For me to leave you alone? Or, or, or hold you as I do? Tight and secure within my arms. Please, you have to put an end to this. Someone may find us. Someone? There is no someone or anyone. Roma, I will never stop loving you. Let's meet here before dusk. What if she finds us? She will never find us. I assure you that. Believe me. My love. Please. Oli, do you you? Yes, me again. Ozumba, I know you weren't expecting me. <laughs> well, I. I. What is it? I, my back, my back is is scratching me. Please, uh, can you help me? Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Ah, no, I, I can't. Why? It's simple. Just, just help me scratch it. It is itching me so uh, badly. Please, please help me, Osuba. No, no, I can't. You know I can't now. Ah, please. Ash. Osuba, if you don't help me, I might go naked. Uh, you know you can't stand that. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> then scratch. Scratch. What am I saying? No, Uma, no. It's not, it's not what you think. Mama, don't mind him, oh. He asked me to come and help me, to help him uh, uh, do something. As I was about doing it, oh, he said to ravish me until you ah, yes. liar! She's lying! Mama, she's lying! Come back here. Where are you going? You rapist. Leave me alone. Eh? You're a liar. Eh? Wait, leave me alone. Uh, Mama. Eddie. Why the stain look on your face? What is it? You had a bad dream? Mm. Aroma. You know I love you, right? But something seems to be looming around you. A day. Yes. 
Vultures do not hover around cops only to display their affections. Eddie, what are you talking about? You're making me terrified. I don't understand. Eddie. Eddie, I'm scared. What is going on? Leave and never come back again. I don't want to see you or have anything to do with you again. Please let me explain. Allow me to explain to you. Oh, let it was hey. just a... Eh? Oh, Zumba! You have no shame, oh. Eh? You have no shame. So after all you did, you still come here to smell my name the more. Eh, hey, Ozumba! Oh, oh, shut up! Eh? Shut up! Hey! Oh, Zumba! Oh, what actually have you come to do? You are so shameless! You are so shameless! So you want to have two close friends? Two best friends for that matter! What a man indeed! My friend, shut up! Shut up! Enough! Enough! Shut up! Enough! Leave my place of abode and this arena now! Come! I'm telling you the truth. She, she's only... Oh, Zumba, leave! Leave! I don't want to see you again! Leave! on my father's grave that Uzumba has been stalking me. Are you serious? Yes. I'm serious. Uzumba keeps telling me things to draw me to him. But you know me, Oledo. I can't stoop so low to have something to do with that he goat. No. Enough. Oledo, stop it. Oh. It hurts to hear such about him. Don't tell me you are still in love with him. No. <laughs> Don't tell me you are still in love with that pervert who wouldn't mind sleeping with two friends and getting me pregnant. Huh? Who told you that? He did. He told me that he wants me to have a child for him. He also told me that when he looks at me, he sees undeniable beauty that he has not seen in other maidens. <sighs> Told me. <laughs> Ma! Greetings, me. Here comes the most beautiful woman of this kingdom. What does the prince want from me? Why are you stalking my path? Your beauty bedazzles me. And I can't wait for a chance to express how much my heart yearns for you. The prince talks the path of a married woman? That is tragedy. Tragedy is that her heart goes after a man that does not look her way. Well, let me be and go after other maidens. Excuse me. Unless I forget, I could suggest someone else to you. My friend Adimka. Do no such thing. Look, I said, listen to me. You will tell her you. Let go of me. I lied against you. My hand. What is it? Sorry. You broke my hand. I didn't mean to. Why are you lying against me? I know. Why are you lying against me? Stop. 
You know I want you in every way, but you will not oblige me. Why? You can't have me now. Why don't you understand? See, it's her that I love. And she, she's the only one I love. <laughs> Why don't you get yourself somebody else? I didn't mean to hurt you, but please, just let me be. Hmm? Just leave me alone. It's okay. I'm off to Keke's place. I want to get fresh pan wine. Um, it's half day already. Are you sure you'll get fresh pan wine? Yes, I will. I already told him to reserve some for me. Why are you staring at me like that? You seem rather happier than usual. Well, maybe I have decided to be happy. And see life from the brighter side. My husband. Your heart longs for me alone. Is that so? Yes, you are. You're my wife. I'll be back. Go well. Hmm. Yes. I am your wife. What your heart longs for her. I, Irene, I will put asunder to every love tale that exalts itself above Irene's beauty. No woman, I repeat, no woman will outshine me in this kingdom. This is a quiet place I've prepared for us, where no one shall disrupt our love. Come, sit. Don't worry, we are safe. It's quiet and beautiful. You like it? Only the birds in the sky can hear us. We are safe. I love you. Please, calm down. No! No! Do you see? How could you? How could you do this to me? After everything? Do you see? I loved you with my life. I... I gave you everything. And how did you pay me? sister of yours mind your words I Irma. do not and you ah. listen to me you bad daughter of no one oh I swear I swear as long as I breathe and stand on the dust of this earth I would destroy you Aroma, I will destroy you! Rima, what's the meaning of this? Stupisi! Ah! Stupisi, what have we done? 
done. We have done nothing. We have done nothing. How can you say that? Calm down. Calm down. I will, I will protect you. We are safe. Protect me from what? Enough already. Please. Ndobisi, go to your wife and let me be. No, 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 no. Aroma, Aroma. Don't mind her. You're the let one I love. Go! Please don't do this. Aroma, no. Let Aroma, me. don't go. Let don't go. Don't go. Me. Aroma! 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 Whoa! Ma, please. Ma, please. I am begging you. You still have the nerves. So come here, Zumpa. <laughs> Ma. Why, why, why are you laughing at me? Hmm? See. Don't tell me you still believe that liar. Don't tell me you're still falling for her whims and caprice. Listen, Ozumba. I don't want this again. Just, just go back to her. Go back to the one you are so engrossed with. And leave me alone. Ma, how do you mean? How do you mean me, me engrossed? So, so you still believe that liar? No, Ozumba. The only liar here is you. I was coming to meet you for an explanation. For me to see both of you holding each other. The way you were holding her very dear to you. Ozumba, I am done. Leave me alone. Please. Ma, Ma, it's not what you think. See, it's not what you think. It's not what I think. Ozumba, stay away from me. Please. Ma, no, don't, don't say anything like that. Eh? Please. I love you. Huh? Please. You love me, Ozumba. It can't be. You can't love me. You can't tell me you love me. It's not possible. The only one you love is Oledo and not me. Go and meet her. Stay away from me. Leave me alone. What is all this? Ede! Ede, where are you? Aroma. Ede. Aroma. Ede. You look on the edge. Yes, it has happened. What has happened? What has happened? And where is that good for nothing sister of yours? Where is she? She's not in. She is not in? Yes. Well, I wish to see her. So go in and tell her that she should come out and face me if she is not scared of me. This is our abode. You do not have the right to come here and demand or ask anything. How dare you? Enough! Do not lay your hands on my brother again. Enough, I said! Finally. Finally she shows forth her face. Aroma. You now have the gods to challenge me. You have the gods to challenge me. Well, listen to me very carefully. I shall crumple you to shambles. I will ruin you and whatever remnants there be left of you. You wish. But I tell you, you can do no such thing. Oh. Really? You heard me. Once again, I say to you, Erima, you will do no such thing to me. Oh. She says I will do nothing. I, Arima, will do nothing. Now listen. Your life is at the tips of my finger. I swear. You will mourn the day you knew Arima and for taking the love of my life from me. You have no conscience. How could you? How could you stoop so low as to fall in love with your own brother? My husband. Now listen to me. I will not warn you again. My husband's sister. I will not. Aroma! Aroma, come! Aroma! Aroma, please, wait! Ozumbam, oh, eh? you and I have 
crossed so many hundreds. Hey? Ma, I've told you time to turn down back. Stop stalking me. Allow me to, to rest in this village. Stalking, you say? No! It's called love. It's the love I have for you that makes me to come after you every other day. Leave me alone. Oh. Mama, yeah? Mama, it's a surprise you are here. How are you? I have come for the man I love. <laughs> really? Yes. Ozumba is the man after my heart. Uh, yes. Well, you are wrong about that. You are the one that is wrong about it. My eyes are now open and I can see the lights. I knew Ozumba never had anything to do with you. Yes. It was all your plot to take him away from me. He is mine. He is mine. He is mine. It is on my chest. He rested every other night. It is my breath he sought to feed his manly desires. Huh? Ozumba, tell her. Tell her how you made love to me. Tell her. She's lying. Ozumba. Tell me she's lying. And I swear I will feed her bones to the wolves. Tell me she's lying. Tell me she's lying. Ozumba! 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 Ah, Ozumba! Ozumba! Who's, who's, who's chasing you? Why are you panting like this? She, 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 she. Who is she? She, 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 she found us. She found us. Hi. Wait, wait. I mean, you mean your wife found you at Aroma? Ozumba. Yeah, Her is about to break loose. How, ah, Undubisi? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. She found us. What do I do? Relax, relax. Let's do it. I'm not relaxed. I can't be relaxed. No, 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 Hey, relax. What do I do? How did this happen? Oh, Ozumba. Ozumba, she found us. Irinma, you mean up to this moment you have not done anything concerning the issue at hand? Irinma, you are kind hearted. Can't you see your husband and Aroma have no regard for you? And you're here asking me what you will do. Can't you see? And you're here asking me what you will do. I know. I know what to do. Then do it. Go straight to the palace. Tell the king what you have seen. Yes. But then my husband. If I report them to the king, he will be severely punished. And you know what that means? I may lose him. Hey! Irene Ma! Sometimes I wonder how you think. It cannot be hidden for too long. Soon, I mean soonest, there would be disgrace. You have to do it. You have to do it. Go straight now to the king palace and report. Put Aroma in his place where he belongs. I heard her voice. Oh. <laughs> Greetings, my friend. I heard her voice. Whose voice? The beautiful Irima. Yes, I, you know, she was here, but she is married. I want to see her. <sighs> my prince. Hi. Why is it that no reasonable man in this village looks my way? Why? Oh, the gods of our land. What have I done wrong? What has Adim Khan done wrong? I... Oh, my prince. Mmo! Where is my one and only friend? Why are you here? Hi. 
I don't stand. I, I'm, I'm here to see you, of course. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Ah. Mama, why are you laughing? And what is funny? <laughs> Stop the pretense, Olido. You and I know that you are jealous of me. Jealous of what? Yes. Me. How? Why? Why? Stop pretending and be gone. You unfriendly friend and viper of a Jasta land. Leave. Mama, how dare you? How dare you use such callous words on me? Huh? Have you forgotten how strong and intertwined we are? May the gods forbid. Oledo, the only person who has forgotten is you. Leave my abroad now, else I will crush you and call the beast to chase you far away. Leave! Oledo, be gone! Enough! Crying? Hey! <laughs> hey! Is that all you can do? Or does those tears remind you of how empty and docilate you are? It seems you are the cause. You are cause. I'm sure you have finally realized your place to this field. As Roma, you are full of death. You are caused just to lust and roam after your brother. Hello, your own brother. Stand here. Let go. Does it hurt? Does it hurt to hear the truth sinking into your heart? Come back here. I'm talking to you. I am not done yet. Get your hands off her. Otherwise, you would not know what will hit you this minute. Let go! Aloma. Aloma, come. Aloma. Aloma, please wait. Since you have refused to stay away from my daughter's husband, you shall remain barren all your life. Because you, your day shall become night, and you shall weep all your morning. Now it is your turn to listen to me. I hereby return your curses to any of your offsprings that suckle this breast of yours. May these curses return back to them and be fulfilled in their lives, not mine. How dare you 